glad we could finally talk. Not much reason. Exactly. So I enjoyed what interesting. I'll be the veteran. I see. You don't need to worry. When will that I can't be? make any problem. I've heard enough and I Good. like you made I'll be there.
Bring it! Joining Evolution feels like a turning point in my career. I mean, everything before this felt big, but now it really seems like I'm on my way to the top. But do you think Randy Orton will be willing to share the spotlight with you? Can you trust him? Randy hasn't always been the most trustworthy person in the past, so I'd be an idiot not to keep my guard up. But I'm hoping he's changed. Would it be safer to just rely on myself? Yeah, but I'm trying to trust the process. Any clue who else will be joining this new evolution? Randy hasn't told me anything. I guess we'll all find out together.
someone is arriving in style. Any idea who this could be? I'm not sure. As far as I know, all the VIPs are already here. Interesting. What's this all about? We've seen these two team before, but I thought it was just a one-time thing. We heard the rumors surrounding Randy Orton. This must be the debut of his newly reformed evolution. Let's go. Led by Orton, Evolution is here on Raw, and they look ready to dominate. I'm having flashbacks to 20 years ago. We put the locker room on notice, but now I want to show the entire WWE universe that we run things here on Raw. When I was in the original Evolution, we did that by holding multiple championships. So we are going to do the same thing. I thought you said I needed to wait my turn to go after the WWE Championship. You do. I've used my pull to get us a match for the Street Profits Raw Tag Team Championships. We can beat the Street Profits. No problem. I like your confidence, but it's not just the Street Profits. It's a triple threat match, with them and the team of Carmelo Hayes and Omos from MVP's relaunched Hurt Business. <laughs> Apparently everyone's doing reboots these days. Yeah, but ours is better. I've decided you two will represent Evolution. I want those tag titles. Don't let me down. Don't worry. After this match, I'll be holding two championships. We got this. It's two-thirds of Evolution ready for tag team action. The following is a triple threat tag team match. And it's for the Raw Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challenger at a combined weight of 419 pounds, The Terror and Gabriel Slate. The Intercontinental Champion and Gabriel are an exciting blend of potential and experience that could reshape this entire tag team division. Sure, if The Lock's actually ready for a partner. And at a combined weight, 610 pounds, Omos and Carmelo Hayes, the Hurt Business. Here we go, guys. We're finally going to crown a new champion here tonight. Cole, this match right here is the absolute definition of history making. Whoever wins this will forever have their name in WWE history books, and that's really saying something.
and at a combined weight of 492 pounds, Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, the Street Profits. These two dudes are legit. They're incredibly talented. They're tough. And they know how to have a good time that doesn't involve a bicycle museum. I even feel like dancing. Montez Ford is one of the best dressed guys in all of sports entertainment. And coming from me, that means something. The new look Intercontinental Champion has teamed up with Gabriel Slade to challenge the Street Profits for the Raw Tag Team titles. And they'll have to go through a moss in Carmelo Hayes while they're at it to win the Raw Tag Champs. I can't remember seeing this much talent in one ring in a long time. Well, Saxon clearly has the memory of a goldfish, but he's right. This triple threat tornado tag match is as stacked as it gets. And I, for one, can't wait to see if Randy Orton's new evolution lives up to the hype. Is it? That'll turn your lights out. Face first with a waistline takedown. And it's Zulu. The temple is being made a target. Ooh, that hurt right to the kidney. Angelo Dawkins with a well timed shot. The challenger's looking shaken. Headbutt vicious. We just saw that. McDonald's stretch. It's locked in. This is a great way to wear it on your. You got to think of a quick counter. He's going to have to tap out. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. That's a counter with style. And he's pulled the ring apron up, looking under there for something. Watch out. This is stand up. Center saw Watch out. Looks like a heat seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion of Corey Winsaw. Psychological warfare from Angelo Dawkins. 
happens here? And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? Punch connects. The two newest factions in WWE, Evolution and the Hurt Business, look to make their mark by capturing gold, but ultimately, the champions' experience teaming together prevailed. Not the outcome the Hurt Business and Evolution were looking for, but I'm sure this is not the last we've seen from them by a long shot. Obviously, things didn't go as planned out there. But what's next? How are we going to regroup? You're not going to regroup. We are. What do you mean? You had your shot, and you lost. Now we're going after the tag titles. You're overreacting. It was one match. I mean, what does it say about your eye for talent if you're already having doubts about me? And besides, Gabe lost too. Gabe didn't get pinned. You did. 
Look, give me another chance. I'll prove myself by doing something really impressive. Like what? I'll beat the Street Profits next week all by myself. Who knows? Could even earn us a title rematch. Sure. <laughs> okay. It's the superstar who's a lock to be on top of WWE for years to come. The following contest is a handicap match. Making his way to the ring from Munich, Germany, weighing in at 199 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, The Terror. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE, about to take part in one of the most anticipated matches ever. Lock yourself to your seats. It's time for this man to go to work. Time to party with the Prophets. And his opponents at a combined weight. Of 492 pounds, the Raw Tag Team Champions, Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, the Street Profits. Fire with the Street Profits out here. I can't even get mad at you. <laughs> All right, Michael, high five. All right, maybe not. Join the Street Profits, choreograph our own little dance inside the club, man. It'll be lit. That's a great idea, Saxon. Afterward, we can all go play in traffic. The Intercontinental Champion may have recently lost his chance to rack up another title, but he's back tonight to take another crack at the Street Profits. The lock seems to have lost more than that. His mind, maybe? A terrible bet? Man, do I hate to agree with Corey, but I just don't see how a handicap match against the Raw Tag Team Champions could end well for the ambitious rookie. himself on the defensive. The locks showing that edge, that ruthlessness. Human. That just reverberated throughout the entire building. Talk about making a statement. Crash landing powerbomb. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Show it off with a big flex. And then a kick to the back. Oh, 
my goodness. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. And Locke is really putting the pressure on. Somehow Montez has to turn the tide. Prime example of working smarter, not harder. That's what I say. Running elbow drop on target. Placing them into the corner. Oh, strikes with the back elbow. Ah, flipping the script on him there. And he saw that coming from Montez. scholars in life there are winners and there are losers we are looking at a winner right now Not bad, huh? Told you I'd show you I was worthy of a rematch. I was impressed, but I'm sticking with the original plan. Me and Gabe are taking the tag title rematch. Why do you think WWE even gave us the rematch to begin with? It was because they just saw me beat the champions all by myself. Is that what you think? I actually went to management and got us the rematch, and you could have blown it by going out there on your own and losing. Yeah, well, I didn't. Look, you already have the Intercontinental Championship. Focus on that. And after Gabe and I take care of business, we'll all have titles. Everyone wins. Gabe, you've been quiet. Don't you think it should be me and you going after the tag titles? I actually think Randy's right. It makes more sense for us to take the match. Exactly. And for Evolution to succeed, we all need to be on the same page. Understood? <sighs> Sorry. You're right. I didn't mean to get out of line or anything like that. Good. So, how did it feel to watch from the sidelines as your Evolution teammates captured the Raw Tag Team Championships? Honestly, not great. I earned the opportunity to be out there, but it didn't work out that way. But I'm happy they won and we're all champions now. You don't sound too happy. What are you getting at? It just seems like you've taken a back seat to Orton. Randy's got a plan, and I'm following it. He's going to pass the torch to me when the time's right. Or at least that's what he's told me. 
I don't want to pry, but is there dissension in evolution already? You know what? I think I've said all I want to say. I don't like to complain, but I'm getting pretty fed up with the maximum male model crew claiming that they're prettier than me. It's not a competition. As much as I've tried to, I can't seem to shut them up. Can you help? The greatest wrestler and the most handsome man in all of Saudi Arabia. Bold statement. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Massey, representing maximum male models from Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. Weighing in at 175 pounds, Mansoir. Mansoir. Once won the biggest battle royal in WWE history. I don't get it. What happened to this guy? I'll tell you what happened, Byron. Mansoir now realizes it's about winning and looking good doing it. Well, let's see if he's as good in the ring as he is on the runway. It's the man who might transform WWE forever. The Lock. And his opponent, from Munich, Germany, weighing in at 199 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, The Terror. Matches like these, with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is in our form. Turn out the lights and close the doors behind you. It's time to lock up. Well, my sources told me that Mansoor and his maximum male models crew have been rubbing. position. Oh, just tap back. Needs to get out of the ankle lock and does so. Well-placed kick. Well, Swan trying to get fired up. The lock put a stop to that. Snapping the neck. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. You want to control the tempo, you want to dictate the pace. That right there is how you do it. Oh. Incoming. Big time power bomb. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. Momentum on the side of the lock. The lock isn't holding anything back. Yes, he didn't come here to watch it post and taunt. And there was some force on that move. No, no, no. Oh. The power, the strength, and now just pressing. And a drop. Great reversal. 
reversal. Yeah. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Oh, just gouging the face. That's not right. That might be it. And he easily kicks out of the count. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Lock design. Hammer lock. Hammer lock. Reverse DDT. Hooked up. Driven down. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Uh oh. Look at this. Uh oh, it's right. And the hits to the core keep coming. Hey, you can't do that. Just how desperate do you have to be? Why not a fair fight, huh? <laughs> Oof. Touch. Nasty. Flat out power. Wow. A deadlift military press. Holy moly. What's this gonna be? Wheelbarrow! Flapjack! Face first. More attacks like that will leave you gasping for air. Well, it looks like it already is. Oh, down, face first. Vicious right forearm. This is just brute power. What a German suplex! And Mansois is brought to a disadvantage now. Every form of offense Mansois attempts is being neutralized. performance. Turning the table! Up and down the hard way! Oh, oh, oh gosh! Cover! Two. And he took the win for the lock. Here is your winner, The Terror! That's the kind of win that can take their career to the next level. You put in the work and good things happen. That's a performance that everybody should hope to emulate.
It's the future of WWE, The Lock. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Munich, Germany, weighing in at 199 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, The Terror. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. The lock has been handed the keys to WWE. Is he ready to drive? Bow your head, Saxton. Show some respect for the queen. The only time I bow my head is when my neck hurts. And his partner from Queens, New York, Queen Zelina. Winner of the first ever Queen's Crown Tournament. Lest we forget, Zelina also became one half of the most beautiful tag team champions in all of WWE alongside Carmella. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about that. She may be diminutive in size, but Zelina is a master strategist inside the ring. And you're about to see her brilliant mind at work. So exciting to see the power of Tazawa. And from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds, Akira Tazawa. I consider myself lucky to have a victory over Tazawa. He is one tough competitor. So if I beat you, does that make me better than Tazawa? Gentlemen, the ninja battle is about to begin. Oh, get ready, guys. There ain't nobody meaner than Tamina. And his partner from the Pacific Islands, Tamina. Watching Tamina devour her opponents That's makes it. my body hurt. Don't even dare try to side-eye Tamina. She'll make you pay for it. She's held the Tag Team Championship, and she's a force to be reckoned with in the women's division. Don't look now, but there may be an alliance for me between two of the most electrifying groups in WWE. We're getting our first glimpse of the Intercontinental Champion and three of a kind's Queen Zelina working side by side. And it's an intimidating sight to behold. Could be the start of a very powerful relationship. Or the end if Tazawa and Tamina find a way to get the last word. Kick to the back. He's taking some good hits. Double axe handle. The upper hand now belongs to Locke. Yeah, can Tazawa recover from this adversity? 
really just laying it in. The lock looking to go airborne. Blast off. Whoa, what a landing. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Get under the ropes. Gets him with the counter. Finally, Tazawa's able to interrupt these attacks for a moment. Tazawa isn't allowing that burst. He just took on to end him. And that was an effective attack, guys. And well-timed maneuver there. Oh, my, what a splash. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. All right, that's it. <laughs> oh, right to the throat. is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Things do not look good for him now, guys. But if anyone can jumpstart a rally, it is Tazawa. Looking for the victory. Oh, Tazawa barely escaped there. How does anyone kick out at this point? Boom! Boom! Tazawa is struggling to defend himself. The lock isn't doing anything back. And now he may get the three count right here. This is it. And there's the save. from the match. Don't look now, but there may be an alliance for me between two of the most electrifying groups in WWE. We're getting our first glimpse of the Intercontinental Champion and three of a kind's Queen Zelina working side by side. And it's an intimidating sight to behold. Could be the start of a very powerful relationship. Or the end, if Zawa and Tamina find a way to get the last word. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. Running clothesline. Saw that coming. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Look at this. DDT. Kneeling. Kick. Oh, nasty flipping sent on. Drop kick right on point. Measured kick to the vertebrae. Tamina now on the defensive. Well, we knew going into this match that it would be physical, Michael, and I'm sure she will tag out when the time is right. Whoa! Wing shot! Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad. Landing. An absolutely Whoa. foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. Don't know if the risk was worth it. They are fading off the WWE fans now, pinning the arm down and oh, stop right to the hand. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. You think you could say that again time to get the let out and she manages to beat the count certainly has a flair for suspense <laughs> drop kick hits hard lands uh -oh. slingshot cross body that was ridiculous absolutely throwing all caution to the wind spinning in the face of danger Prepare your face for that. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Got their opponent set up. Oh, a drop kick to the spine. She's starting to tire a little. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course, they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Oh, God. Zelina is just doing whatever she wants. Unrelenting attacks from Zelina. Tamina showing how much punishment she can withstand before dishing it back tenfold. Tamina hoping to start a rush of her own with that attack. Oh, nasty flipping center. Running her Colorado. Beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash. 
That is just insulting. Drop kick to the back. Brutal face buster. Shoulders down. This could be the one that does it. And you know what that means? It means she probably has something even more devastating to finish her off with. So ruthless. Tamina being controlled by the opposition here. Tamina has to devise a new plan here. And here they come. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Queen Zelina at a combined weight of 419 pounds, The Terror and Gabriel Slate. Gentlemen, this has all the makings of an all-time classic match, and I fully expect it to deliver on that promise.
and their opponents, accompanied by Shayna Baszler at a combined weight of 458 pounds, Butch and Ridge Holland, the Brawling Brutes. A duo that always delivers when it comes to tag team action, and the WWE Universe is ready for it. Well, it didn't take long for the Intercontinental title's new alliance with three of a kind to hit a Sheamus size speed bump. The Lock and Gabriel Slade will be looking to run over that speed bump, and they'll have to do it against the always fierce Butch and Rich Holland. With Queen Zelina and Shayna in opposite corners, we could be in for some real fireworks tonight, fellas. Uh-oh, headbutt! Nothing fancy there. some damage already. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh, impressive counter. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. He drops. That was nasty. So precise. Measured elbow drop, driven down. Steady charge here from Slade. Slade is picking up steam. performance. 
Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Kick gets caught. Oh, no. Oh, back to the belly. Popped him right in the face. Answer after it. Here we go again. Look at this power. This is unholy. Look at that for reps. Guys, he put it away. That's a pretty big one. of showing by this tag team. Gives you hope for the future of the tag division. Great tag team action on display, guys. Take a good look at the new face of WWE. It's The Lock. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Queen Zelina from Munich, Germany, weighing in at 199 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Terror! The Lock may be naturally gifted, but he's had to work incredibly hard to make it this far. That's according to his mentor, former WCW wrestler Tavish, who's seen the Lock's grit up close. I know he's one of the toughest competitors around, but you're gonna have to raise it to a whole new level with the Celtic Warrior. This superstar better be prepared for a healthy dose of physicality in this one. his opponent, representing the Brawling Brutes from Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus! Nearly 15 years into his WWE career, Sheamus still manages to deliver banger after banger 
Okay. After banger. We got it. After banger. Would you stop? After banger. Oh my gosh. After banger. Quiet. After banger. Shut up. After banger. I love it. After banger. Ugh. After banger. With three of a kind in shambles, the lock goes one on one against WWE's ultimate instigator, Sheamus. You might want to check your math, Cole, because I count one, two, three superstars in Sheamus's corner. And no. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. And the world pushes the ground. Great effort, though. Knew what was coming there. Ooh. Tickets to the gun show. Kick to the back. Shane was looking a little shaken here. Oh, that can squash you. The fight is being taken to Sheamus. Yeah, Locke is proving hard to keep up with. Oh, the lock gets caught with a counter. In the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Shifts it back onto him. Sheamus asking the double. Not allowing that to go on any longer. Battered instincts from Sheamus. He's getting a huge boost. Saving us from having to sit through that. Kick to the back. The power, the strength, and now just pressing. And a drop. Flash. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. And that toss sent them soaring. Locke launching attacks left and right. Look, Sheamus loves a fight, but he can't be liking this. Stop after stop after stop. Sheamus dodges that one. We have a European uppercut. It could be over here. This is it. And his shoulder is lifted before one. This deep into the match, and he's able to kick out before a one count? It's stunning. What noise. And there's the cover. He breaks the pin before a one count. I'm having a hard time believing that one. to the end. He can really stand to get back. Up and down the hard way. Oh, oh God. Try to end it. He kicked out a two. Sheamus powered out. The Celtic Warrior proving his toughness tonight. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time.
impressive win for this superstar, that's for sure. That was an unfair match from the start. The WWE Universe was constantly distracting Sheamus. Oh my gosh, where is the violin? It's the future of WWE, The Lock. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, from Munich, Germany, weighing in at 199 pounds, The Terror. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. Lock yourself to your seats. It's time for this man to go to work. The animal has been unleashed. And his partner from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal Batista. Oh, the animal will punish with no remorse and no mercy. Batista's story is that of indescribable rage.
He has this insatiable desire to inflict pain on his prey. Yeah, it is really frightening when you think about what Batista is truly capable of. He won the Royal Rumble in two different decades. He's a decorated champion, a Hollywood action movie star. And Batista doesn't care what anyone thinks. He's obsessed with what he wants, and what Batista wants is domination. Time to unleash the rage. It's one of the most seasoned superstars in WWE, Gabriel Slade. And from Columbus, Ohio, weighing in at 220 pounds, Gabriel Slade. Real talk, Gabriel Slade is running out of opportunities to make the leap to the next level in WWE. No time like the present. He's one of the most experienced superstars in WWE and will have to rely on his know-how here tonight. One of the most prolific competitors in WWE history. Without question, a man who has exhibited over 25 years of dominance in sports entertainment. And that dominance will continue before our very eyes tonight. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game, Triple H. It's all about the game and how you play it, and nobody plays it better than Triple H. Oh, the cerebral assassin. An unbelievable talent in the ring. The sadistic son-in-law of the chairman of WWE. Now the intimidation and mind games have already begun for Triple H. Because the moment the music hits, Triple H begins to defend his kingdom. Well, that's because Triple H looks at every competitor as a threat to his crown. We are about to see a battle here tonight. Some good old-fashioned tag team action here. There's such a distinct attribute that makes a tag team successful. It's an indefinable quality. We're about to see which one of these teams possesses that X factor here. Yeah. Oh. Ninja driver. Referee in position. Yeah, seem to be just testing the waters a bit there. Tag is registered. Oof. Where's the haymaker? Catches a punch. And Locke gets surprised there. And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Oh my, what a splash. Power slam. Good night. 
The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Hard landing. Triple H getting dismantled here. Rough spot for Triple H to be in. Oh, I had that well scouted. Triple H able to take a stand there. You can't push the game that far without getting some retaliation. Intimidation, part of what makes Triple H the cerebral assassin. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. <laughs> what a headbutt. Vicious. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Charging up the arm, and ooh, what a close line in the corner. team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. An elbow drop for added measure. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. Just dead lifting right there. The power. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing four. He may get the three count right here. I think so. He got the shoulder up in time. Still in it. What a gutsy performance. What a barrage of stops. This can do it. Great officiating. As the ref noticed, he was on the ropes. Triple H has turned his attention to the WWE faithful. Oh, close line. The game's starting to look beaten here. Holding on by a thread, maybe even less at this point. Clubbing forward. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Ooh. Strong impact from Triple H. Big punch finds its mark. And we see the attention being put on the torso area. Jarring impact. Oh, Slade with a course correction. Oh man, you can see he is feeling it now. He finds an opening. Fist directly to the gun. Across the top rope. Clubbing four. Double axe handle. Drops the hammer. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Victory. This right pairing can certainly do wonders, and make no mistake, this was a wonderful performance tonight.
Be honest. Do you think we could take Batista and Randy Orton? You still booking fantasy matches in your head? <laughs> you don't? I mean, it's hard not to make the comparison between our two groups. And then you start to think about how we'd measure up against the breakout stars from the original version. It's kind of a waste of time to think about because I know we'd beat them. They were good, but the sport has changed a ton in the past 20 years. I don't know. When I picture it in my head, it's a lot closer of a matchup. I mean, can you imagine? It sounds like you want me to try. They're here! The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 419 pounds, The Terror and Gabriel Slate Evolution! You are looking at a team that delivers a tag clinic every time they compete. But tonight might be their best lesson yet. The animal has been unleashed. And their opponents, first from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal Batista. A multiple-time world heavyweight champion, a Royal Rumble winner, Batista has earned his spot atop WWE. A founding member of Evolution, but the animal himself has evolved to the top of the food chain in this industry. Unparalleled success, both in the ring and in Hollywood, which is insane because for some reason, the WWE Universe has never appreciated Batista quite enough. Well, no question about it. Batista will demand the respect of the WWE Universe right here tonight. The Apex Predator is here. It's hard to believe it's been two decades on the hunt in WWE. And representing Evolution from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton. The definition of a WWE superstar, and in my opinion, there is no one as gifted in this game as Orton. Now, oh, Corey, I agree. Legendary factions, all-time tag teams. But Randy Orton is best when he does some solo work. And when he's doing said solo work, Randy Orton is one of the most sadistic individuals the WWE 
has ever known. The more hostile the environment, the more at home Randy Orton seems to be. Well, Randy Orton has made a career out of psychologically dissecting his opponents. And many of the victims who have fallen for the Viper schemes stay down for good. Writes his own story in Venom. Randy Orton can't be controlled. Taking it old school tonight with a little two-on-two -two tag team action. Doesn't get any more classic than this. You truly get the best of both worlds, and sometimes pairings you really didn't see coming. Hey, kind of like you and me, Corey. I would very much like to be excluded from this narrative, Saxton. Big splash! Just being dismantled. A killer instinct from the lock is shining through. Enough already. Uh oh. Batista turns it around, and Batista needed that badly. Time now for Batista to get his energy up and claw back into the fight. their opponent back to their feet and up oh my discus punch and in a turn of events the animal found himself unleashed on with that attack and yeah it's about time to heavily consider tagging in that partner oh, heavy duty right hand just punched him right in the mouth relentless enough already and the locks maintaining the advantage now the animal has got to turn the aggression on to survive But 
Batista. Chop-lock, a debilitating counter there. Five. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Seven. Just continuing to dismantle their opponent. Affecting his equilibrium. Double box handle. Oof. He had it scouted. Oh, what a DDT. He's going to pay this command. There's a shoulder up almost immediately. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. Attacks up in the neck area have gone way too far. Listen, someone needs to ring the bell before this situation worsens. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. A back suplex right out of the apron. And he slides him back to the mat. together great chemistry tonight tag team excellence in its purest form you simply love to see it and i hope we see these guys tagging again real soon